Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're gonna be doing a what's on my iPhone. I love watching these videos and I want to document what's on my phone because future me, I want to look back and be like, oh, this was on my phone at this point. So that's what we're gonna be filming today. So I have the iPhone 15 in the pale yellow color. I don't know if it's picking up on camera. No, my phone is just being washed out on camera. But it's the pale yellow color on camera. It's just looking like a blob with two cameras. So I need to hold my phone open ever so slightly, otherwise my screen recording will stop. On my lock screen, I just have the date. I have when the sun's setting because I love knowing when the sun's setting so I can go and catch the sunset or the sunrise. Usually the sunset, I don't want to be up that early. 10.53 as I'm filming this. And then my widgets are, I just have a shortcut to Snapchat. I have Spotify, honestly the best shortcut you can have on your lock screen. Then I've got the temperature. Again, I like knowing what the temperature is outside. And then I also have the battery for my AirPods. So this is my first screen. Screen, but we'll swipe over one and it just has at the top it has the battery for my phone for my airpods case and also my airpods themselves and then we have just a little pinterest widget and this is one of my boards it's just called cute stuff quite self-explanatory it's cute stuff then it has the date and then weather another weather app don't know why i have two weather apps but two weather apps and at the bottom it just has spotify and this is going to take you to apparently drake um <laughs> but i just take you to spotify i have lots of different playlists i have my may playlist which is my usual one that i use and my spotify is linked in the description i don't actually remember what my spotify name is but the link will tell you and then i just have loads of other things and one of my favorite podcasts to listen to at the moment probably a better you by fernanda ramirez i think that's how you say her name i absolutely love them i have not listened to some in a while but i absolutely love them they are so motivating i need to start listening to them more that's gonna be a thing i'm gonna start doing and then we swipe onto my home screen it's just this picture i found on pinterest i think it's linked in my electronical stoof i said stoof yes that's how what i named my pinterest board and then on my lock screen i just have my pinterest widget this is directly straight to my pinterest home screen it's just got some pins that would be on my pinterest home screen if i went onto it now then you've got another calendar widget i've got snapchat i've got instagram i've got bereal and then i've also got tiktok and then on the main hot bar at the bottom i've got pinterest i've got got life 360 i've got youtube studios which is just if you're like a content creator for youtube you can check out analytics reply to comments on the go because usually you can only do it on your laptop so you can have more accessibility and i've also got spotify my pinterest i have i do post occasionally i don't post that often i mostly save pins honestly pinterest is like my alter ego personality i live and die for pinterest on to the next page i've got spotify stats which is a separate app that you link your spotify to and you can track your streams your minutes your tracks your artists and your albums and then also you can compare with friends you can collect records you can see who you've been listening to the most that certain week or you can check lifetime in the past four weeks the past six months 2024 and today specifically i've not had my spotify account for this long so my overall minutes is 102k whereas i live and die for my music i have music on constantly and then you go down and there is another pinterest widget i don't know which board this is it's just my clean girl board and then next to it i just have some of my like tv widgets i have have apple tv i have netflix i have youtube and then disney plus as well and then below i have my pixel pals app i absolutely love this you can basically choose your creature and you can look after it i need to actually look after mine let's quickly do that um give you some cookies should you give otter cookies? Probably not, but I'm giving my otter cookies. Then fight different creatures. And if you've got a newer phone, I think iPhone 15 upwards, your little creatures will live at the top of your screen, which I think is really cute. And that's also why I downloaded it. I'm gonna fight the strawberry real quick. Then on the next page, I've just got a massive widget of Sabrina Carpenter. It shuffles through different photos of Sabrina Carpenter. I love that woman. And then below, I just have some of my, I don't really know what apps I'd class these as. I have Premier League, I have Bottom I have Formula One, I've NBA. I have Happy Color, I have Xbox, Game Pass, and then the PS4 app. I love my Xbox. I love all of these apps. I go on them constantly. I actually probably go on them on a daily basis, most of them. And Happy Color, if you do not know what that is, I am obsessed with it. I color in on a daily basis. It is just an on-the-go, stress-relieving app. You can lit there's like, they li are always constantly updating it. And my current one, and there's also daily ones that you can do. And they have a whole Disney section, which I am working my way through. I haven't done some in a while. But the last one I did was Peter Pan and 
and Wendy. But if, you, if I scroll down, you can see I've done quite a few of the Disney ones. And then on the next page is my... It's just got some random shopping apps. This isn't all my shopping apps. I just wanted to fill up more pages. I've got a widget of... Oh my God, I forgot her name. That girl. You'll know who she is. With her shopping bags. Because wouldn't that be nice to go to these fancy shops and walk out of all those shopping bags? That would be beautiful. And at the top, I have uni days, which is just for students to get discounts and free things. And the first one that pops up is get 25% off at Levi's. So you'd have to show your uni days card and then you get loads of different discounts. Like look, you get 15% off coach bookings for National Express. You might want that. £10 off your first two orders over £15 for Uber Eats. Like it is honestly endless and they're constantly adding new brands and companies and places so you can start getting more discounts. And then have shop, which is just tracking my orders. Influencer, I think. I saw on TikTok and I downloaded it not long ago. If you review products and there's a chance you can get sent product by those brands. I have Brandy Melville, Hollister, H&M, Urban Outfitters and then Lush. Some of my apps are offloaded for storage reasons. And then the last page I have, I have this colour widget at the top that says good evening. I don't know why it says good evening. And then tells me what the day is, tells me I recently played music. I don't trust this completely. I think it's cute. It tells me my battery percentage when the sun sets and my steps today. And then below I have a photo widget that shuffles through my personal photos. So currently showing a photo of my death. I then have Lowe, which is a period app. I have Pure Gym, which is the gym I go to. I then have Strava, which tracks like your exercise, like runs, walks, jogs, all that. And it gives you designated routes and you gives you inspiration for routes for your specific area. And you can join challenges. You can do it with your friends. There's loads of different things you can do on Strava. I've then got the health app. And then I've got some, this is just random apps, honestly, that I wanted on my home screen. I have Minion Rush, self-explanatory. I have Fruit Ninja. I have Heyday. No you know and I also have Idol Cinema Empire I just downloaded this I haven't played it yet it looks really good and I want to play it I then have StockX which is where I would get shoes trainers all that sort of things from then size again is shoes trainers etc so I've got most of my shoes from actually my two Nike shoes I then have Cineworld the cinemas oh my god I spread my back like it's just my hair we're okay and then lastly I have SoundCloud which is where I listened to either Reverb Slow Down Sped Up or I listen to unreleased songs one of them I love listening to is Come Through by The Week Weekend. I also listen to like Billie Eilish songs and I listen to a whole bunch of different songs on here. This is just the last page which is obviously my whole app library. I'll give you a quick run through. Obviously I've got a recently added, I've got social media, I've got music, I've got utilities which is just like your basic sort of app. I really to go through and organise this because there's half these apps I don't even use anymore. Productivity and finance which is just basic school app which I do not need to use until September so they will be not on my home screen. I used to have a whole page on my home screen dedicated to school which will be the case once I go go back to university. I finished college, I don't need the apps there anymore. I then have travel, which is just a bunch of travel apps. I've got some from Denmark, traveling. I then have creativity. Again, I don't even use half of these. I used to delete half of them, so I have more storage. I then have entertainment. I have other health and fitness, games. I'm just go through and delete half these games. I don't play all of them. I then have some shopping app. I then have information and reading. I got my Animal Crossing app. I forgot I had that. I then have education. I, I start practicing my driving theory. I need to do that. I then have food and drink. Oh, that's me hungry looking at this app. I then have Arcade, which is just arcade games for Apple. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you did enjoy. And if you have any video suggestions, please let me know in the comments because I'll happily try and get through and do some of them because I don't really know what to film at the moment. I'm sort of just filming videos I want to do, videos I like watching. But thank you guys for watching this video. Bye.